this is episode 25 of my let's play. Now I know I've skipped a, a little while, <laughs> but uh, I've been busy. I've been doing all the spikes around here. I'm trying to upgrade them now, at least to the one before the, the full upgrade. Um, I know that they will get damaged, but if I spread them around enough, it should be okay. I'm going to put a few of these spikes out as well, which I've just pricked myself on. And, you know, like a couple of rows of that, just to damage them before they get to there. So I'm just going to upgrade these. Whoops. I do want to upgrade them all the way, uh, but I've been down in the mine. And I collected quite a bit of iron, so that's what I'm going to have to do, just make sure I collect all the iron up. And hopefully I'll be able to upgrade the wall fully. And then just replace the ones that get damaged or broken. Once it's fully upgraded. Now, I haven't seen any holes, but I have been down in the mine. Uh, I think they collect quite a bit of wood. And there we go. At least they're upgraded to there. Uh, I got quite a bit of wood to make sure that there's three rows of the big spikes. Um, either side, I don't know whether I did three there. But I'm going to do them all the way down here. So then when this is two out, it'll be, I'll still have some over. So I'm going to do this both sides now. And then upgrade these to the second, uh, third level, I think it is. So one, three, yeah. Hopefully, uh, this would be enough to deal with any ferals uh, that come along as well. So, I did collect quite a bit of um, lead as well while I was in there. Uh, I think I got two stacks of a thousand of the lead. Uh, so, I want to start cooking that up soon and get prepared for this evening's hoard. This will be the test. I need to get the uh, ceiling bit done on, on that one. Um, I'm hoping I've got enough wood to do that. I haven't dug out any of that just yet. Uh, that's going to have to wait. Uh, so I'm going to do a couple of rows of these spikes as well around just to just to give it some extra uh, extra protection so it's three rows all the way around each one so I know it seems a bit extreme, but it just means I can spread them around a bit and save uh, so much damage happening on on like a concentration of spikes because that's going to break them. At least if oh, that disappeared for a second there, uh, if uh, if I can stop as much damage going on them, at least that way I just have to repair. a little less upkeep than having to replace them and then upgrade them from this. I would ideally like them all upgraded fully, but time and resources uh, are against me, I'm afraid. another 2,000 gone already. Ok. 
Okay, so. Probably do with some more wood as well. Um, oh, don't ruin them already. Why? Seriously, why? Thank you. I'm going to take that just because I can. Ugh. Yeah, I've got... Um, Quite a bit of lead in there now. Uh, I've got another another thousand left. Oh, uh, some more wood. Yeah, I collected quite a bit of wood, so I could uh, continue with it. I only got a thousand crushed sand, so but I got plenty of stones while it's down there as well. This is just to repair the cobblestone rocks that I've got there as well, anyway. So you know, the on the outside, there are a couple that I need to repair. Right, so we're just getting ready for the hoard now. It's uh, it's going to be upon us very soon. Um, I'm just hoping that the that the base sort of holds out and we don't end up too um, yeah too damaged. I ended up <laughs> upgrading a couple of these when <laughs> I didn't mean to. Um, yeah, that one's damaged. I don't want to get a bit too close because of that. Um, I keep pricking myself on them, as you can see, with my uh, health. <laughs> I got a little bit too close. Uh, we do 50 so far, and then we can at least... Uh, Started. I think I um, left some upstairs, or did I use them all? I can't remember. I'm just going to go around with one one row at the moment, just to but like I say, I haven't heard any hordes sort of go over while I was mining, but I, I am pretty far down. Um, underground so why is that not going there oh because of the small stone can't see that yeah pretty far underground with it i've dug quite a way i, I found a, a vein and i just kept going i actually got myself lost at one point uh, within the within the mine, <laughs> I had to end up putting a block up to show me which there was the exit out. That was the only problem when you uh, just keep mining, just keep mining. You, you can get yourself turned around and then get lost. But it was okay. I mean, I got I got quite a bit. I I did some um, spam crafting while I was in there while I was mining, and I got my tools up to at least blue now, so that makes it a little bit easier. I also spent some of my uh, skill points. I uh, got another couple in those, well another another one I think in those ones, uh, that one's all the way, so that's fine, that's that's brilliant is that, because then at least I don't lose as much durability on these, um, what else did I do, uh, I got the bullets, uh, I thought I might as well, might as well get all the bullets and then they're, in, then they're done, the construction tools is nearly up to a uh, hundred with all the upgrading I've been doing. Uh, the minus 69er, I did that all the way. That helps with uh, the block damage. So the block damage is 100%. So, And I don't lose as much stamina now when I do that. My scavenging is still kind of low. Um, I haven't really been doing that much scavenging. And uh, I 
I think that was it. I could do the treasure hunter again, so I might as well do that while I'm... Because that's what I want to do after we've uh, had the hoard. We're going to go and do that treasure map that we've got and see what we can find there. See if there's anything interesting. So that's one row of spikes of these little spikes now. Um, all the way around. How many's here? I think I might do actually two rows of the of the big spikes here. Yeah. Because the light the light coming in here, so shall do that. Two rows there. I didn't upgrade them. See if I can actually reach from here. Yeah, I can. There we go. I do want to do two rows of these these uh, little spikes. At least it damages them before they actually get to the bigger spikes, so it might make them last a little bit longer. I'm hoping. I mean, there's been some damage on them here, look. Oops. See what I mean about me, like, in damaging myself? I'm going to upgrade these ones. Because when they do climb up on... on there, they drop down onto those ones, so... As I'm going out. And then at least they're done. I think I'll just repair these. I know it's easy to just sort of smash them up and then and then just replace them, but I could just do that as well. Let's no big deal, I just stood in that zombie. And there's two rows there, so that's another row. Go around and do those. Like I say I want at least a little bit to to damage them. Um, if I had time I'd put barbed wire up as well. I th think it's um, cops tonight. I'm not sure if that is in the 21 day. I think it is. Mm. So that's going to be fun. We'll see how these uh, spikes fare with that and the vomit. I think the, if the cops vomit on these they'll just be annihilated straight away. I don't think they'll hold up very well to the cops. But I mean they can blow cars up. So, I didn't think cars could blow up anymore. I didn't think he could blow them up now. Um, unless I've just misread something. But that really did spook me. <laughs> it was bizarre. I must admit that it was very funny. I say, I just want to get this this done and prepared for the day. Well, the night, the night, uh, the night hard. So I'm hoping it'll be okay. But what I'm going to do after I've finished doing this little bit is I'm going to go and get some more wood um, and make some frames and do that floor up there. Just so, you know, it's a little bit safer if I do decide to run across that way. To lead them through there. I 
think it's probably the stronger wall than this one. This one's still got cobblestone on. Up top or on the corners, it's got some cobblestone. They're, they're the, that's the cobblestone I need to uh, re repair. I do have the cobblestone on me. There we go. I think we've got um, one, two, three, four. That's got another bow. And I think that. Fine. I think that will be okay. I think that will um, at least damage them enough to yeah it should damage them enough to um, kill them with the other spikes. I'm going to replant these while I'm here so then I can make some food as well. That's something else I need to do. Let's do the food. the coffee as well. Yeah, we need to do some more arrows as well. We also need to make some more shotgun shells. Um, that's something I'm going to have to... Whoops. That's something I'm going to have to go down and do when I'm, I'm preparing everything else. Oh, go away. Oh, really? I haven't got time for all this. Why do you stand up and go, thank you, I need that. I can't be bothered going inside. No, I think I'm on second stage now. I got um, some more dogs after we got back from the airdrop and... Uh, I'd run out of um, <laughs> I'd run out of stamina. Fortunately, though, I didn't actually die. Um, I managed to get away from them and then pick them off. So, but it was a shock because I thought we'd already had them. You know, with them all those that had come up earlier on in the morning. So I was just running back here and I started putting these bars back up and I heard them behind me. I, luckily enough I could just run backwards up here and, and like I say I managed to get away and, and then pick them off. But so it was quite a shock. Okay. So that's that. Don't know if I'm going to have time to do everything I want to do but uh, we shall soon see. Anyway guys I'm going to leave you here. And when you come back, it will be just before the Horde Night, and we'll see where we are with the build. Okay, thank you for watching. I'll see you soon. Bye for now.